So in this film we will look at how we use the formwork and the separator to create the composite cobbage wall. So the wall is made up of 300 millimeters of a dense structural cob and 300 millimeters of a lightweight thermal cob. Here you can see that the separator has been inserted between the formwork and the gap left is being filled with the dense structural mix. The mix is placed in up to the height of the change of angle in the separator. This gives you the depth of your first layer Yes. which will be probably around 250 millimeters. The separator has an angle on it as well, which creates a zigzag effect and aids the join between the two materials. At this point here, the first layer of the structural mix is nearly complete. They are just tamping down the surface and then adding a little more material to make sure the whole area is full. At this point, the separator can be removed. It is designed so you can give it a wiggle to help separate it and then pull it out. So you can see now that there is a space left which you can then fill with the lightweight thermal mix in order to complete the composite wall. Once the thermal mix has been added, the whole process starts all over again. La faible longueur de ces coffrages intermédiaires permettent de les glisser entre les barres de fixation du coffrage principal. On peut les déplacer au fur et à mesure de l'avancement du remplissage de la bauge. Il faut prendre garde de ne pas compacter la bauge au-delà de l'angle formé par les deux plans du coffrage intermédiaire. Cela rend compliqué le soulèvement et le déplacement de ce coffrage.